Hey everyone, so in some point of your life, you must have came close to dying, right? It's happened to all of us at least once. Currently, I've had four near-death experiences. Do you want to hear them? First one was when I was a child, probably around the age of five. And like any kid, I had eaten a hard candy and started choking. Are you ready for the ironic part? It was a lifesaver. Luckily, my mom was around, and with a few slaps of the back, that little demon candy just flew out. Ooh, lifesavers. Okay, left all the right ones. Ah, uh, whatever. It's not like it's gonna kill me. <coughs> well, speak of the devil, I'm choking. Maybe it'll pass down? No. Maybe melt in my throat? No, can't wait that long. Oh god, I should call for help. <laughs> Alright, I'm choking. How can I do that? Maybe if I scream in my head so loud, somebody will hear me. Jumanji! Hmm, that really didn't do anything. Well, I guess this is it for me then. was a close call. Mm. The second time was when me and my friends were strolling around the streets at night and in the far far distance we could see these guys with like bats in their hands. Uh, luckily for us we crossed the street and headed in a different direction because the next day we read in the papers that a group of guys got beaten with uh, guys with bats with them. So the third one was probably about, uh, I think, two winters ago because uh, it snowed really bad that year, so the roads are just terrible. And I was going down uh, this intersection that I go every time to work, and it kind of crosses, it kind of goes down a hill, and it crosses another intersection that crosses across from it. So I'm going down the hill, and I put my brakes on, and then I started sliding. It was just five seconds just going down that hill. Luckily, at the very, very last possible minute, I was able to stop. No, no, not like this, not like this. Maybe if I pump the brakes. No, that's just making it go faster. Think, think. Did I take Breaking Bad tonight? Wait, 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 why am I thinking of that now? Of course, the e-brake. Oh, shoot, the e-brake is already on. What if I turn the heat up all the way, then it melts the snow? That's just stupid. Well, I guess this is it for me then. I regret nothing! <gasps> Holy Moses! Breaking Bad is a repeat tonight. And the fourth one happened to me just a few days ago. Do you see that light fixture behind me? Uh, well, I have the exact same one in my bedroom. And the one in my bedroom, the light went out, so I replaced it with uh, the light bulbs that last a little longer. But they're a little bigger than the ones uh, in there. So, you know, I unscrewed the light fixture, uh, switched the light bulbs, and when I tried to put the light fixture back on, it wouldn't like screw on like perfectly as it did before. Um, but I'm like, ah, oh well, as, lo as long as it's up there, it's up there. Then a few days later, I usually do like a few exercises like in my room, you know, a few push-ups, a few sit-ups, uh, just like right under light fixture and I was like looking up at it, I'm like that would be so bad if it just fell. Right when I finished like doing sit-ups, I walk away from the room for just a few seconds and the light fixture just falls with a huge thump. Never been so close to death in my life. So the question I have for you is, what is your near-death experience? If you guys like this video, then hit the sub at the top and the like at the bottom, and I will see you guys later.